hey everyone so here is a question and this is a important and interesting question the question here is find x and y that x y is equal to 72 and x plus y is 17 so here they have given x y 72 and x plus y is 17 then how to get the value of x and y i cannot substitute x uh, is equal to 17 minus y in this in either way i'm not gonna get the answer so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna use our identities okay we're gonna use identities to get the value of x and y so here we're gonna use the two different identities since they have given x plus y it's plus right so i'm gonna take a plus b whole square that formula this formula i'm going to use to get this now since it's given in terms of x and y i'll not take a plus b i'll, to, I'll take x plus y whole square so we know that okay let me write down what is given in the question so they have given two things one is x y which is 72 and they have given x plus y which is 17. now x plus y whole square it is equal to x square plus 2xy plus y square now here i know the value of x plus y i know the value of x y so i'm going to substitute here so x plus y value is 17 so here i'll get 17 square this is equal to x square plus 2 into in place of x y i am going to substitute 72 so 72 plus y square now still here i don't know what is the value of x square and y square now 17 square is 289 so 289 is equal to x square plus 2 into 72 is uh, 144 plus y square now i'm going to transpose this 144 to the other side so we'll get 289 minus 144 is equal to x square plus y square subtract them we'll get the answer 145 so 145 is equal to x square plus y square or you can write down x square plus y square is equal to 145 still we didn't get the value of x and y we got x square plus y square is 145 but we want only the value of x and y then how to solve so here i'm going to use my second identity so here i'm going to take x minus y i will not take x plus y because if i substitute back here i'm going to end up in the same starting what i got so i don't want i'm going to use a different identity second identity i'm going to use so when i use second identity which is x minus y whole square this is equal to x square minus 2xy plus y square now if you see here we know the value of x square y square that is x square plus y square or let me just rearrange this so this is x square plus y square minus 2xy i'm just rearranging the terms here here we know the value of x square plus y square here we got which is equal to 145 we know the value of x y it's given the question we're going to substitute this so this will be equal to 145 minus 2 into x y is 72 it's given the question so x minus y whole square now when i substitute or when i open this i'll get 145 minus 144 so x minus y whole square is 145 minus 144 so x minus y whole square will be equal to 1 now x minus y whole square is equal to 1 right if i take a square root so this is x minus y is equal to square root of 1 which is equal to 1 again so here we got x minus y value which is 1 and already we know x plus y is 17 so i'm going to use these two statements now we know x plus y is 17 and here we got x minus y is equal to 1 i'm going to use this two equation to get the answer so i'm going to erase this part here so if i substitute here x plus y is equal to 17 and x minus y is equal to 1 
right so i'm going to use a column method i'm going to add them so when we add them i'm doing addition here x plus x will become 2x y minus y will get cancelled will get zero here you can just write plus zero or you can just leave it so this is equal to 17 plus 1 is 18 we want only the value of x we don't want this 2 so transpose this to other side so 2 is in multiplication when transpose this to other side comes in division so x will be equal to 18 upon 2 so cancel it we'll get the answer 9 so therefore we got x is equal to 9 now we got x now we're going to get the value of y also substitute in any one equation substitute either in x plus y or substitute either in x minus y i'm going to take x minus y so x minus y or you can just take the first one x plus y is equal to 17 we know x value is 9 so 9 plus y is equal to 17 take this 9 to other side it will get subtracted so y is equal to 17 minus 9 which is 8 so y is equal to 8 so this is how we got the value of x and y this was quite lengthy problem it was simple we have to just use the two identities to get the answer i hope it's clear now in case you have further questions or doubts you can drop a comment below thank you so much for watching